I'm very surprising that there are so many people, you know, in Europe. Uh, it's difficult to organize this kind of, of congress. And um, so my feeling in it was so impressive and the organization is very well and the people are so kind. So it's a really pleasure for me to come here and I'm very proud to be here. And I would like to thank uh, Professor uh, Ceconello to invite me uh, in this prestigious Congress. In the esophagectomy, there are two issues, uh, the survival and the morbidity of the, of the esophagus. So we have to, to try to, to find the best way uh, to improve uh, the lymphadenectomy uh, and this is the reason why I have uh, presented a lecture in, in which I have stressed uh, on the quality and uh, the uh, extensive um, uh, dissection for the lymphadenectomy uh, with the patient in prone position and with a minimal invasive surgery and probably that the thoracoscopy in prone position is the best. But um, the problem is for the second issue, which is the quality of the, um, the gastroesophageal anastomosis, which can um, result in a long postoperative stay who have no consensus. And uh, this is the reason why I have present three possibility: the linear mechanical staper, the linear, the circular mechanical stapler and the manual suture. I have proposed to do a manual suture, but I'm not sure that it's the best way to do uh, this anastomosis.